Good morning, Dennis Smith, and it's two-minute drill time again, focusing on the hog market. This is the hedging time frame. We've been talking about this for a long time. I'll say between now and the 4th of July, if you haven't really got your positions as far as your hog hedges in place, you know, you could be uh, missing the boat. At least that's the way we see it. One thing to take a look at, August hogs. If this contract has not taken out the April highs by the 4th of July, that's a really negative indication, in my opinion. Deferred hog contracts are struggling to hold rallies. We've just got a lot of things going on. Let's not even talk about the trade issues, the fact that NAFTA may be going away, the fact that we are no longer shipping pork to China, uh, the fact that we could introduce tariffs on imported automobiles, which is going to create some real problems with Japan and South Korea. Not even going to talk about that. We're talking about the fact that packers are losing money now. They've been bidding strong for hogs. Hog supplies are tight. The problem has been is the product has not really caught fire, and this is the major disappointment with the trade. Demand has been good. Export demand has been outstanding, but will it hold? Indications by the cutout the last couple of weeks indicates it will not hold given current record large production levels. We are hedging hog futures. Recommend to take a look at both futures and options. These are my thoughts and not those of ADM, nor are they the thoughts of ADM Investor Services or of Archer Financial Services. Thank you.